guys, welcome back to another week of What's for Dinner. My name is Andrea with Foodimentary Adventures in Food. This video is a little bit different. As you can see, I'm not in our regular setting at a restaurant or at our house. That's because I'm in the hospital. I just had our sweet little baby today and I'll introduce you to our baby another day. But what I decided to do this week is, since I'm gonna be in the hospital for a few days, is show you what Howard and I had for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Yes, Howard and I, because at this particular hospital, they do serve the, um, the fathers of the babies. So I'll start with mine. And um, so this hospital lets you pick what you want from a pretty decent menu. So I got um, meat lasagna with broccoli, and I got some, that's some salad dressing on the side there, and I got some cantaloupe. And then this is a Caesar salad that I picked up. And Howard chose pot roast. Beef stew. Oh, I'm sorry, it's beef stew right there. He got some beef stew with uh, mixed veggies and some mashed potatoes. So this is what um, we are having for dinner tonight. And then I will be back in the morning to show you what we are having for breakfast. Hey guys, so let me show you what we are having for lunch today. I completely and totally forgot to film breakfast this morning. I was a little fuzzy headed, totally slipped my mind, but this is what we're having for lunch. We pretty much got the same Pete, the same thing, <clears throat> excuse me, which are individual little pizzas with um, pepperoni and mushrooms and um, I think it's onions on here. So this is what we're having for lunch today and I'll show you what we get for dinner. Hey guys, so let me show you what we are having for dinner tonight from the hospital. So this is Howard's plate and he got some um, green beans and then he got a um, herb roasted pork chop. So here that is and then he also got some mashed potatoes and then he got some um, soup and it is fire roasted veggies and then it came with some crackers he got some water for dessert he got some vanilla flavored ice cream and then this is my plate i got some tomato basil soup and then i also got some steamed green beans and i had the lasagna i think it was yesterday actually and it was pretty good the meat lasagna and so i got it again it was delish for my dessert i got an oreo parfait here it is, oopsie, this is what it looks like. And then I also got some crackers for my soup. I got some water and then I wanted some grape juice. So um, not too shabby for a hospital dinner. So this is what we are having for dinner tonight and we will see you guys next time. Hey guys, so let me show you our breakfast this morning. This is my plate. I have some French toast, um, a piece of turkey sausage, and then I also have some bacon and cranberry juice. This is Howard's plate. He has an omelet with um, different types of meat and onions, and then he has some toast right here as well. And then they just gave him some extra white bread, and he has orange juice and ketchup. So this is what we are having this morning. Again, this is the hospital's breakfast and we will see you guys next time. Hey guys, so let me show you what we are having for lunch today. Howard and I both have the same thing. So we are having french fries and a bacon cheeseburger. There it is. And then I got um, cranapple, I'm sorry, not cranapple, cranberry juice, and then um, Howard just got some bottled water. So this hopefully is gonna be our last lunch here at the hospital. Um, you know, like I said, it's not bad, but you know, kind of ready to get back home. So anyway, this is what is for lunch today and we'll see you guys for dinner. Hey guys, so I am showing you, hopefully, our last dinner here at the hospital. This is Howard's plate. This is the same thing that he got yesterday, right? And this is the same thing? The exact same plate. So this is the, um, like a grilled pork chop, green beans and mashed potatoes. For dessert, he got vanilla ice cream. For my plate, I got um, baked macaroni and um, broccoli. And then I also got some orange sherbet and some grape juice. So this is what we are having for dinner tonight and we'll see you guys next time. 
Hey guys, I am back filming the final meal from the hospital. I totally forgot that when they discharge you, they give you a lasagna dinner to take home, which is a wonderful, wonderful idea. So let me show you everything that was included in the dinner. These are the instructions that came on the bag right here. And so um, they give you a tray of lasagna and you have to go home and you know pop it in the oven but the lasagna is really really good so you get a tray of lasagna and then they also give you oh, i said a tray i meant like a foil pan and they also give you a foil pan of mixed veggies squash um zucchini and it looks like some there's a um, tomato back there but we did not feel like eating this tonight so we didn't cook it so um, we're gonna save that for another occasion. So I'm just gonna pop it back in the fridge. And then they also give you some breadsticks uh, right here. And then they give you some salad dressing to go with, sorry, I'm moving everywhere. The salad that they give you, and um, it came in a little box, so scooped out some salad. And then they give you some cookies for dessert. Looks like chocolate chip and sugar cookie. So um, I'm excited about that. So this was a really nice treat and I totally forgot that this hospital did that. I mean, cause the last thing you feel like doing, whether you're, when you come home from the hospital is cooking or thinking about cooking. So anyway, this is the final meal from the hospital. I hope you guys enjoyed this um, video. I know it's a little bit different than what, you know, we normally um, have, but I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please give us a thumbs up. And if you have not subscribed to our channel, I hope that you'll do so. And we'll see you guys next time.